This isn't your average trip down Charlotte's rail trail. Spare tires, extra clothing, cycling clothes, work clothes in case I can find work along the way. Dan Hurd is eight months into a three year jaunt across the United States, but he's only been an avid cycler since 2017. It started right after his third suicide attempt. When I got out of the hospital and got back a little bit on my feet, um, I was already honestly planning my fourth attempt. And uh, fortunately for me, my best friend got, had tried for many years to get me on a bicycle, and he finally did. Filling a void, Heard made it his mission to hop on his bike and go the distance, literally. Hitting 25,000 miles comes with a subsequent goal of raising money for To Write Love on Her Arms, a nonprofit that gives hope and help to those dealing with addiction, depression, and suicide. I'm a veteran. I've dealt with childhood uh, abuse, dealt a lot of early age drug use. And I've dealt with long-term depression my entire life, so you know they really focused on everything. He tells us his biggest challenge so far was the Blue Ridge Parkway and parts of mountainous Virginia. Days that are struggle, like there's a lot of struggle involved in it, but you know as long as I make progress, that's how I try to stay positive. Another hurdle: Herd's doing this with no savings. Through the kindness of others, he's been able to stay with strangers and secure meals along the way. Overall, it's a journey Herd tells me he knows he has to be on. So, like I said, I started this project for myself, maybe mainly to heal my own life. And I've been very fortunate to have 43 people that have told me they haven't committed suicide from seeing what I'm doing. Eventually, Heard would like to start his own organization for suicide awareness, encouraging other survivors to be a part of the healing process, too. In Charlotte, Rebecca Vote, Spectrum News.